Are you more hungry to get the best physique, the muscle, or are you more hungry to eat like everyone else and look like everyone else? The choice is simple, a momentary joy of cheating or the lifelong satisfaction of achieving greatness. people seek shortcuts, dreaming of a magic pill that delivers a Mr. Olympia body in a month. But there is no magic. It's all about hard work, day in and day out. Nutrition is the most challenging part because it's a 24-7, year-round commitment. never be a miracle drug. If you're overweight, you won't lose that weight without dieting and working out. If you want a great physique, you have to diet. It's always been that way and nothing has changed since the 70s. Even Arnold Schwarzenegger did it. Arnold Schwarzenegger wasn't the leanest bodybuilder. He looked more like a power lifter with his bulky appearance. Arnold's secret mass gain diet, which he rarely spoke about publicly. This diet totaled over 5,000 calories with around 300 grams of protein per day. At 7.30 a.m., Arnold's first meal included three whole eggs, four to eight ounces of beef, two pieces of butter toast, and two glasses of whole milk. His mid-morning snack at 10 a.m. consisted of half a meat sandwich, one hard-boiled egg, and one glass of whole milk. As you can see, milk and dairy were staples in Arnold's diet. Supplements were also big during the golden era, and Arnold had two protein shakes a day. Back in the 60s and 70s, bodybuilders used high volume, high frequency training to build muscle. These intense workouts could last three to four hours.
12.30 p.m., Arnold ate one whole meat sandwich, one cheese sandwich, two glasses of whole milk, and some fruit. lunch at 3 p.m., his mid-afternoon snack was one hard-boiled egg, three slices of cheese, and two glasses of whole milk. At 6 p.m., dinner included 8 to 12 ounces of ground beef a baked potato with butter, a salad, and two glasses of whole milk. Arnold's nighttime snack was a homemade high-protein shake consisting of two glasses of whole milk, half a cup of non-fat milk, one whole egg, and half a cup of ice cream. This is how Arnold ate over the years consistently refining his diet to build his classic Mr. Olympia physique. He went overboard in the beginning with a 5,000 calorie per day diet plan, but it all paid off. What's tough about bodybuilding is that it sticks with you even after you leave the gym. It's not just the training, you can't forget about it when you go home. In the 70s golden era, bodybuilders didn't have the advanced technology to build muscles that we have today. They lacked the high-tech exercise machines, theories, and wide range of supplements and drugs that modern bodybuilders use. Arnold had incredible genetics, but he still followed a strict diet. If you want to become your best version, stay committed to your diet and stick to it every day.